electoral politics. In this chapter, we will look for the people to govern through their elected representatives, necessities of election in a democracy, and lastly, the basic difference between democratic and non-democratic elections. Elections In democracy, administration is run by the representatives who are elected by the people. The process by which people elect their representatives is called election. Voters People who have the right to vote or participate in the election of representatives are known as voters. Why do we need elections? Election takes place to choose people's representatives. A rule of the people is possible without any elections if all the people can sit together every day and take all the decisions. But this is not possible in any large community to take the decisions on all matters or issues. Therefore, in many democracies, people rule through their representatives. How do voters can make many choices in election? In democratic country, for the selection of rulers, voters make many choices such as they can choose who will make laws for them. They can choose who will form the government and take major decisions. They can choose the party whose policies will guide the government and lawmaking. The main features of democratic election are as under. Every adult citizen should have a right to vote. Everyone should have one vote and each vote should have equal value. There must be some competition between candidates and political parties. Votes should have some choice. Parties and candidates should be free to contest elections. Elections must be held at regular intervals after every few years. Elections must be free and fair. People should be able to elect representatives of their choice. Elections are thus all about political competition. But an electoral competition clearly have many demerits. It creates a sense of disunity and functionalism in every locality. In an ideal works, all political leaders know what is good for the people and are motivated only by a desire to serve them. Political competition is not necessary in such an ideal world. That is all about this topic. In the next topic, we will learn about the pattern of our election system.